everyone welcome back to my little corner of the internet i hope you are all doing well as you can tell by the title today is another pregnancy related video and it's going to be uh, some clips that i filmed when i told my friends and family that i was pregnant we will get straight into it so the first people that you're going to see that i told are my parents so my parents for those of you that don't know don't live in wellington where i live so it was a lot easier to keep the secret from them because i wasn't seeing them all of the time um, but Nick and I were heading up to spend Christmas with them and we were flying up on Christmas Eve and I knew that there was absolutely no way that I was gonna be able to keep it a secret until actual Christmas Day I just thought a I'd be way too excited I just want to tell them straight away but B I knew that there'd probably be times it would like want to have a glass of champagne or a glass of like bubbles or a gin and tonic or something because it was summer and it was Christmas Eve so I knew that I would gonna have to tell them Basically, as soon as we got there, otherwise they'd probably suspect something was up. And literally, as soon as Nick and I got to my parents' house, I think it was around like midday at this point, uh, my dad asked if Nick and I wanted a beer. And I was just like, uh-huh, sure. And then just like left it on the bench and obviously didn't drink it. So I knew that I wanted to capture my parents' reaction so I could tell my sister who lives in Spain. So she obviously couldn't be there when I told my parents. And also just for me to have and to share in this video as well. But my parents don't normally like being on camera. So I knew that I was gonna have to come up with something to make them not suspicious, but also be in my video. So we have a few Christmas and Christmas Eve traditions. So I told them that I was filming a video all about the Christmas traditions that I wanted to get up on Christmas Eve. So I had to like film this last shot with them and then like edit and upload the video that afternoon. So there'd be like a sense of urgency. So that is why there's a little bit of a ramble at this clip of me telling my parents because they were under the impression that I was filming another video. Okay, so we have made it up north where my parents live. This is my parents. And the last Christmas tradition that I want to talk to you about is a Christmas Eve present. So I feel like this is something that we've always done. We don't normally buy a specific present for Christmas Eve, but for the purpose of this video, I have done just that. So mum and dad, oh, Merry thank Christmas. You. Ooh, thank you. Rip, rip, fine then. <laughs> That's very uh, good. What does that tell us? Is that oh, right? Is that a you, Christmas? You're kidding! Oh, oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh that's pretty good. God. Nobody wanted to give it up. Oh my goodness! Oh, that's great. Oh, wow! Thank you, get a secret. Oh, honey. <laughs> Cry. <laughs> well done. Just in case you didn't catch that, for both my parents and Nick's parents, we got them a book that was called like How to Be a Grandparent essentially. Um, and when you opened up the front cover, it had a picture of our 12-week ultrasound inside. So I didn't film giving it to Nick's parents, but that I do talk about it in my first trimester update, which there will be a card to up above if you want to check that out. Next person that you're gonna see a clip of is my sister, and as I just mentioned, she lives in Spain, so we had to FaceTime her. She is actually in New Zealand right now, and I was gonna wait and tell her but I wanted her to be one of the first people that I told and I knew that in between telling my parents and like when my sister arrived there would be like a lot of other people that would be seeing that I wanted to tell as well so I told her over FaceTime you will see in this clip that I did an absolutely terrible job of filming because at first I had the camera sitting on like the side of the couch while we were FaceTiming her but I was scared that she'd be able to like very obviously see the camera and wonder why I was filming her so I tried to be like holding up the book uh, that we got my parents and also like holding the camera at the same time and it totally failed so don't look at this clip just listen to it. Do you want to see what um, I got mum and dad as a Christmas Eve present? Yep always. What? Wait sorry. <laughs> Are you kidding? No! Oh my god! <laughs> So because my sister is actually staying with me at the moment, I thought it might be cool to not necessarily reenact, but get her opinion or like her side of the story of what you were thinking when I told you that I was pregnant, since uh -huh. I did such a fail of filming it. Right. Okay, so I was cooking dinner at the yeah, time right. in Spain. It was Christmas Eve for me. It was Christmas morning for her yeah. in New Zealand. Um, and we were just talking and you were like, oh, you want to see what I got with dad? And I was like, sure, I love seeing you present. Great. Yeah. yeah. And you had a book. I was like, cool, a book. And then I was, <laughs> it, had, <laughs> it had a kettle on the front of it. And I was like, oh, that's weird. Is it some book about like, coffee making or something? I don't know. Because I was on my phone. Yeah, yeah. So it's pretty tiny. It's like, you know, this little screen that I was looking, trying to read the title <laughs> of the book on. And then I was like leaning closer and I was like, wait, grandparent? <laughs> And then basically I just started crying. Yeah. <laughs> and then you were making pad thai for dinner and then tell them what you said. I said I something like I've always got to remember pad thai. Yeah. <laughs> Think about your baby. <laughs> Lucky baby. Yep. <laughs> 
but yeah, I was very excited. And then she told me that we were keeping it a secret for a while and I accidentally told some people because I couldn't keep it. <laughs> I'm just too excited to be an aunt. Yeah, well, people Please. I didn't know, so that's yeah, fine. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you know, I didn't tell the whole internet or anything like that. <laughs> yeah. I'm just, I'm very excited. Um, we've already been shopping for baby stuff. You might have said that already. Yep, no, nope. that will be coming in a video yeah. in a couple months, probably. Uh -huh. And I went out pretty much the next day. Well, not the next day, because it was Christmas for me, but the day after <laughs> that, and started buying some cute little baby clothes. <laughs> so I was like, I have a reason to go to the stores now. <laughs> On Boxing Day of 2019, we went to go and have a bit of a belated Christmas lunch with my grandpa and I told him that I was pregnant via a Christmas card that said like as an extra special treat you're also going to be a great grandpa and it's just going to be his first time being like a great grandparent which I thought was really cool as well. Uh, and my mum was very kind enough to uh, capture this little reaction so here's a funny clip of my grandpa finding out as well. I noticed the moment you came in. Did you? <laughs> it sticks out a bit. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Next up is a bunch of our friends that we had around for a barbecue and some drinks on New Year's Eve. And I thought it might be a cool way to tell them by like setting up a fake photo like some people do and then announcing that we were pregnant. So that is what we did. And the reaction was quite funny. Some of them were too busy posing for the photo to even like notice what Nick had said. And some of them just thought Nick was making like a really weird joke and it wasn't until I confirmed that I was pregnant that they got it so enjoy this clip as well. Three, two, one. Sammy's pregnant! Oh. No. What? <laughs> Surprise! Really? Oh, oh shit! Yeah. I was like what are you drinking? <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, congratulations! Usually. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh is this well, a good photo? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> And last but by no means least I have the reaction of my best friend Hannah. So before we found out that we were expecting a baby Nick and I had planned an anniversary, a wedding anniversary trip to Melbourne and my best friend lives in Australia so she decided that she was going to come to Melbourne as well so we could see her. It was also going to be Hannah's and my like 10 year friendship anniversary so it was really cool to celebrate with her um, and I knew that I wanted to tell her in person. I think if we hadn't planned that trip she probably would have been like one of the very first people that I told. Nick and I had been in Melbourne for about a day or two when Hannah and her mum flew in and they were staying quite close to us and there was like uh, a pub or like a bar in between kind of the two places that we were staying and they were really hungry so initially we met there for a drink and to catch up and then we had like Christmas presents to give each other so we went back to our hotel uh, to like get the Christmas presents and then also that's when I told her. When we met them at this bar Hannah and her mum already had a drink and we went up to order a drink and I asked the guy if I could just have a tonic and lime so it would look like I was drinking gin and tonic but obviously without the gin in it and he said really loudly so you don't want any gin and I was really worried that Hannah had heard him say that and then as we were sitting there I looked at Hannah at one point and I thought she was looking at my tummy I think she was just like looking around but at that point I was like shit she so knows that I'm pregnant so that's why in this clip you'll hear me ask her if she already knew um but yeah enjoy this last clip of telling my best friend all right it's a bit later on in the day and i'm here with hannah hey we've had a good catch up and i've been dying to see hannah because i've been dying to tell her that i'm pregnant <gasps> no did you know <laughs> I thought you knew. <laughs> so that is it. Obviously we did tell a lot more of our friends and family. I just didn't record it. Um, but hopefully you enjoyed watching this video. I'm so pleased that I have these memories like captured and videoed of telling some of the most special people in my life that we are pregnant. Um, sort of off topic but I feel like I might also film a bit of a pregnancy Q&A at some point. So if you have any questions about pregnancy in general or about my personal pregnancy journey please leave them for me in the comments down below or chuck me like a tweet or something with them. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're all having a wonderful day and I'll see you all next week. Bye!